So we're in the Chukchi Sea, beautiful day, um, and we are essentially following the ice edge. So ice was here, um, you know, a couple weeks or so ago, and following that, there was a big uh, phytoplankton bloom uh, in the water column. And over time, that settles out in the water column until it actually ends up on the bottom of the seafloor. So that chlorophyll, that algae material, we can actually quantify and measure at the bottom of the ocean. And that's essentially what we're doing here. We just sent down what's called a Van Veen grab, which collects sediment at the, the bottom of the seafloor. So we're about 45 meters deep here, and it took a, a not long, just a couple seconds, a few seconds to get to the bottom. And once it gets to the bottom, there's a trip on the Van Veen, and it just shuts very quickly. Um, and it brings up a nice scoop, scoop full of, of mud, essentially, seafloor sediments. So the sediment chlorophyll, the, the chlorophyll biomass that ultimately dies in the water column and sort of settles out on the seafloor is very important because it starts the bottom of the uh, seafloor food web, the benthic uh, food web down there. So there's lots of different sort of um, you know, feeders that feed on that plant material and then there's other organisms that, that eat on those on those grazers and ultimately that starts an entire entire food web at the, the bottom of the ocean and it ultimately links all the way back up to, to walrus and spectacled eider as diving sea duck and all sorts of different uh, species that are very heavily reliant upon the food web that sits at the bottom of the ocean.